Hey, what's up, YouTube? <clears throat> Sorry if you can't really see me. <clears throat> um, it's really, really hot out, and I can't do it in the sh I can't do it in the s in the sun. Uh, so I'm doing it in the shade. I mean, you can see me a little bit, but probably not very well. Let me see if I can. Yeah, maybe that's just a little bit better. Um, so I got my package from Siggy's World. Awesome, awesome, awesome. I'm really um really super excited and today's review is actually one of the packs from Siggy's World and it's gonna be the Marlboro Ice Mint and eh, smoking kills smoking seriously harms you and others around you <coughs> um yeah pack design it's it's pretty sick I like it I don't like this little part though um yeah I don't really like this, but anyway, I like the the blue. It turn it turns from a light blue to a dark blue, and then it has like a a sky blue color outlined by the ribbon thing right there. And then it says Marlboro Ice Mint, and then Marlboro right there. And on the back it says Underage Sale Prohibited. For duty free sale only. So, I'm not too sure what that means. But, yeah. I don't know if these are FSC. It doesn't show it anywhere. Normally, there's an FSC right there. <coughs> Alright, I'm going to go ahead and take the cellophane off. Or, oh, I already took the cellophane off. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and pop these open. Okay. Foil has a little ribbon right there. And kind of like a plaid design. I don't know if you guys can see that. It's kind of plaid. And yeah, let's take this bad boy. Out. Wow, really? It's really soft. Yeah. It's like the foil's not like the regular foil. It's really soft, kind of like cloth in a way. Okay, put that down. And the filters are white. Take a look at the cigarette. Has a white, uh, standard white filter, blue uh, stripe around right on the the filter. It says, I don't know if you guys can see that, but it says Marlboro in blue, and then it says Ice Mint right there in like silver. Um, yeah, I'm trying to get you guys a close up of it. Ice Mint. Anyway, <coughs> it's kind of a reflective color. Hmm. Has a really strong, minty, fresh uh, smell to it. Hmm. Okay, let's go ahead and fire it up. I'm gonna get my lighter. Yeah, really hot day in California today. Hmm. <coughs> the first drag doesn't really have that. Uh, that burnt paper, but it does have that FSC, or not really FSC, but that chemical taste. It's a little bit. Really good body, it has a really nice body. I give it that, it actually got my eye a little bit. Yep. Yeah, that sucked. All right, well. I'm going to go ahead and take a nice pull of this <coughs> and inhale all the way down to the bottom of my lungs. No real harshness, very smooth cigarette. Has a really nice body and has that minty, not menthol, minty flavor. And that's what I like because menthol kind of comes off... Um, it see to me menthol. I like menthol, but n not really that much anymore. Uh, after smoking so many menthols um, and doing so many reviews on them, I'm not really getting. The, I'm not really liking the menthol flavor too much. Uh, it just reminds me of that those cough drops, those plain, nasty cough drops I used to. Uh, I used to eat when I was sick. So, but mint, different story. It is. Uh, I, I I do like mint. It reminds me of gum. Like Trident or uh, Stride, you know. Wow. 
Yeah, they do um, leave that really cold feeling. Normally when you smoke a cigarette, like a full flavor, you get that, or even sometimes even uh, some menthols, you get that really like hot, warm feeling in the back of your throat when you inhale it. This is cold. This is like a cold, like ocean breeze type deal. It's I like it a lot. This is a really good cigarette. It's just fresh. It just reminds me of fresh. And I thought that it would say the nicotine levels on this one. On all the other ones, um, it do on most of the other ones, it does. So, um, like here, for example, the next review I'm going to be doing <coughs> are the Dejarum Black Cappuccino flavor. Uh, where is it? Yeah. And there's the nicotine level. See how it shows 1.8 milligrams of nicotine, 25 milligrams of tar. Wow, that's a lot of tar. Holy shit. Alright. I'm going to go ahead and take a drag, blow it out my nostrils, and see if I can really, really get the mint flavor. Whew. And I am a little bit congested. So I am enjoying this a lot more than a full flavor. <coughs> um, it really did clear out my sinuses. Whew. It's really nice. Oh, don't fly away on me. Really nice flavor. Hmm. I'm going to get one more of the body real quick. Maybe it was just the first couple drags where you get that really big body. <clears throat> but, um, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and jump into the ratings with this one. The buzz factor, it, it's there. Um, it's really nice. But um, package design, I'm going to give it an 8 out of 10. I love blue. Silver's pretty sick, too. So I'm going to go ahead and give it an 8 out of 10. Body. I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna go ahead and give it a 7.5 out of 10. And flavor, taste, and aroma. Nine out of 10. I mean, oh, definitely worth buying. Marlboro Ice Mint. And burn time and quality. Burning, it's burning decent. Um, quality, yeah, burn time and quality, I'm going to go ahead and give it an 8 out of 10. So overall, for the Marlboro Ice Mint, I'm going to give it a 8.5 out of 10. Really good. Really good. Alright guys, be sure to check out Siggy'sWorld.com. They have awesome stuff, awesome products, um, decent pricing. I mean, they just have a variety of Kratek cigarettes, uh, standard cigarettes. Um, these were made in Switzerland. I don't know, the, I can't read the rest. Made under authority, uh, Philip Morris brand, Sarl Nietzschetel, Switzerland. So, yeah, I can't read it. Yeah, somewhere in Switzerland. Alright guys, have a good day. Smoke on, stay lit. And thanks for watching. Be sure to check out SiggiesWorld.com. I'm going to post the link down below. Alright guys, peace out.